ELI5 Why is it such a big deal if source code is leaked? League of Legends and Team Fortress 2's source codes were leaked. But if you install the game, its source code is right on your computer right? So you'd be able to alter it anyway? I have no clue how this black magic would work. Source code versus installed game is like a recipe versus a cooked dish. If you were served a dish, doesn't mean you can make the same dish. Or even modify it. Edit wow. I'm so happy how do I monetize this. Lol. I've seen a lot of good answers as to source code versus installed code. So instead I'll go into the negatives of it being leaked. If the original source code is leaked, any person with working knowledge of coding would be able to mine the code for data. That data can be used to either leak hidden features in the game, create cheat tools for the game or worst case it can be used to create programs that interfere with the game's netcode, causing either crashes for players or getting players banned permanently. I feel like the mid-90s were the golden age of any files. There used to be so many ways you could edit or modify your game just using Notepad. Heck, you could use Notepad to make yourself as wealthy as you wanted to be in Diablo. The installed game is like the devs lead you through a labyrinth blindfolded. Meanwhile the source code is like a map of the labyrinth. You don't want to know people how your labyrinth looks like on the inside. Because they could found shortcuts exploits. The leaks could lead to exploits of the existing system's designs or to programs which use design flaws to modify the games. When the game is installed on your computer its code has gone through a process called compilation, which basically translates it from human-readable code into a mess of ones and zeros. The main problem with people having the source code is that they can actually understand it. Unlike the code installed on their computer, which means they may be able to use it to find bugs, exploits or secrets in the game, or to make hacks with. It's not a big deal for a game like League of Legends. There's nothing unique about the model. It's the fanbase that matters. What's someone going to steal? TBH it usually isn't. No one can actually easily monetize the code because it is still protected by law, along with music and visual artwork not to mention the name itself. For those that want a slightly more technical example, the source code is the human-readable code. The code you run is computer-readable. When you download a game, the devs have used a piece of software to translate between human-readable and computer-readable, and give you that computer code. You could try to translate back. But a lot of things get moved out of order for optimization. Imagine chewing a sandwich then returning it to the plate and trying to convince someone it was. Ever even a sandwich. Usually it means you get the equivalent of someone stealing your homework. Or someone having the blueprints to your well-secured home. The difference between having an executable binary file the program installed versus the source code is the difference between getting a tour of the White House and getting the blueprints. One of them is more useful if you're looking to have fun. The other is more useful if you're looking to build your own or worse, find and exploit security loopholes. Having the source code will allow people to make clones of the game. Insert malware in the game. Pirate the game in any way. Basically alter the game at their will. Costing whoever created the game tons of money. Source codes in games are heavily encrypted and locked behind heavy security making it next to. Impossible to get at. You'd have to be quite skilled at hacking and have the know-how to do it properly.